Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. I'm starting this video with a bit of a twist, I guess. Um, I need to start by sending a bit of an apology directly to Matty Craft. See, we had this collaboration going in the pipeline for about a year now, even a, a little bit longer. He originally planned to send a parcel to someone who would send it to me in Hong Kong, but then I left Hong Kong and then it got delayed and then it went somewhere else and it, it, it was so badly delayed. And by the time I got back from England, I was just slammed with so many other projects, it just kept on slipping away. So I do sincerely apologize for the delay on this video, Matty. I really hope this doesn't affect our relationship going forward. I think your figures are just some of the greatest on this earth. So I really hope uh, we can keep on working together in the future. So without further ado, let's check out Matty Craft's video. A very long, sadly delayed video, but one that I think is definitely going to hit home on just how high quality these figures are. Make sure to sub to Matty Crafts and let's check it out. All right, strap in everybody. It's Matty Crafts time. <laughs> this is uh, actually how he sent it, just with one black piece of tape. <laughs> okay, so he has sent me a ton of figures. I've not looked at any of these yet. I just, I don't even know what they are. I know there's some flood because I definitely requested some. Matty Crafts, today I give you epic figures that I have made. I hope you enjoy them. Thank you very much, Matty. Yeah, truly, I, I think I'm gonna enjoy these. <laughs> I think, um, I think I'm gonna like what I find in here. So how many have we got? One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wow, nine figures. This one's already. F oh, 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 what do we have here? That looks like a 2023 Mega Constructs Flood figure, let me tell you that much. <sighs> okay, starting off strong. You know me, I love love my custom flood figures. I have so many now. And I actually have another flood showcase coming uh, just around Halloween. I think it's gonna drop on Halloween night. Man, that is so cool. I, I, I that is so dope. Okay, where do I begin? Um, first of all, I always love, the thing about flood is there's no mistakes. You can make a flood figure. You can't make, you can't make a bad flood figure, right? Because it's literally just biomass. It can be anywhere. And what I really like about flood is you can push armor apart. So look at this, the chest or specifically the back piece has just been ripped off almost because the biomass has uh, sort of entered inside and expanded and just pushed it out. It's like when you open a, a bottle of water on a plane and it pops because of the air pressure. <laughs> a little bit more extreme than that, but you get what I mean. And these, this flood arm looks very, very similar to the new articulation flood we're getting next year. Oh my God, I'm so excited to get a whole wave of new articulation flood. These uh, tentacles are actually, I think, yeah, these tentacles are custom made, so I gotta be careful. They are not, you know, a lot of the time you just cut them off the uh, flood forms and then you can put them on the combat form. But no, these are handmade, so very nice there. I, I think I'm particularly impressed by that arm. That is really great. All right, a flood combat elite is our first figure and you can't get much better than that, but I imagine we probably will. What do we have here? What do we have here, Matty? Ooh, ooh, I like those oranges. Is this an arbiter? Ooh. Yes, look at that. Wow. Holy cow, that is a sick looking elite. Definitely some kind of arbiter. This headdress is enormous. It's actually enormous. I think this is a jackal's arm. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I recognize that uh, change of uh, sort of hue, sort of skin tone. I think that's a jackal arm. I've said this before, I love 
sharp contrasting colors. I especially love things like Oni operative Spartans that have like a neon pink or blue or yellow to them, like an electric yellow. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Like it's so royal. It's like he, he maybe he's not going into combat per se. He's uh, it, it's almost decorative, I think. And does it remove off? Yeah, there we go. So this is molded on top of what I believe is an arbiter head. I think this is mostly an arbiter figure. And the way that that is molded on top and can be a, a removable headdress is so fantastic. I love it. I love it. I love the one exposed arm as well. Phenomenal. What do we have next? Matty. Oh, this is so exciting. Oh, is that another flood arm? Oh, yes, it is. Is this a Spartan? Oh, it's an ODST. Flood infected shark fin ODST. Wow. Again, the uh, little tentacles are custom made. The arm is custom made, but just so sturdy. Like, that's actually really strong. Very powerful resistance there. I love how the biomass is just sort of sludged over. There's loads of just brown leakage over the armor. The ODST helmet is just pushed off to the side there. It could almost fall off, but I imagine the head's still inside, hence why it's still attached to the biomass. Beautiful. Ah, it's so terrifying. A flood a Elite and ODST. I made a custom showcase while I was in England of all my custom flood and I guess once I go back to England I'll have to make another one because I just have too much custom flood. What do we have next? Ooh, I think this is a brute. Ooh. Ooh, what do we have here? Okay, okay, is this some kind of Tartarus? It could be some kind of Thrall Slayer. I like this custom belt, very nice. This brute, uh, I don't know why, well, I do know why. He looks way too small. Elites have gotten the nice uh, new articulation treatment. Brutes, I mean, they've got good treatment, but um, they could do with being uh, a little bit larger. I'm trying to figure out what figure this originally was. I, I don't really have any idea. That's a very nice brute. I would happily have him commanding some of my troops on the battlefield. Awesome. Let's check out the fifth. Is this, uh, whoa, what is this? <gasps> is it a, pro is this a prophet? Is this a prophet? Oh, Matty, you're giving me the royal treatment, sending royalty. <gasps> Look at that. The royalty is in the house. Another prophet. Wow. I'm doing this video, uh, I'm doing a, a live reaction to it. I don't want to do my research and know what figures I'm getting. So I'll put all the information on the screen of what figures they are with links to if Matty made videos on them. This is pretty dope. He's got lots of like scratching all across the back of his robe. And then, yeah, so it's almost like very weathered. Like uh, he's been through some things or she's been through th some things. She's got like a Princess Leia headdress, but it also has horns on it. So it's a little satanic. I'm not sure, but that's so dope. I'm, I'm really happy to have another just right just general uh, profit. I'm gonna be making some profit mocks because uh, I have all three now, right? I'm gonna be making some mocks when I'm back in England. So it would be nice to just have like a consultant uh, profit or something like that. Okay, okay. Five figures, so impressed so far. Is this another flood? Yes, Maddie, you know what I like. Oh, Maddie knows what the domain likes. Oh, ooh, oh gosh. What, what poor fate has, uh, oh, double arms. Nice. The double claws are a great touch. This one, uh, low key, yeah, I think this one's uh, a bit more impressive than the other two. These are great, these are really great, but this one uh, has so much more sort of etching into it. It's like he learned how to, uh, to print into drying clay. I like this effect more than the other two. The dual uh, claws is so Wolverine-y, I love it. This chest also looks really fantastic. Wow, Matty. Matty, Matty, Matty. I'm, I'm so happy, I uh, just wanna say, so happy to finally review some of your products. And I really do apologize for how long this took. I really do hope it doesn't affect our relationship in the future. Cool, we got three figures left. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Ooh, yes, it's a brute. Ah, uh, and he's got, look at that. Ooh, is this sort of Fist of Rooked vibes? I, I love the, uh, the clay that looks like some kind of binded rope. Very nice. And a brute bodyguard to go with it. Oh, oh, shoot. This 
is by far my favorite, by far, immediately. I'm like, <laughs> immediately that is the winner. Uh, oh my God, that's so cool. And it's, he's got a hand sticking out of his back, which I assume is for the hammer. Funny that it's a hand and not a peg, but that's, uh, that's, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, that is a brute. That is a brute and a half. My gosh, my gosh. That is a real, that's a real monkey right there. Let's see, face reveal. Oh, it's the Halo Wars 2 face. Oh my gosh, the pouch there, really nice level of detail. I love the leather and how it sort of matches uh, the hammer with his armor. It definitely makes it feel like it's his identity weapon, like he goes everywhere with it. And the exposed skin on his uh, hands is cool. An elite shoulder strapped to his leg. I didn't even notice that first. That is so sick. Matty. Wow, wow. You, you can tell. You, you can always tell in a review when I, I'm actually blown away by something. That is truly impressive. I love this Arbiter too. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. All right then. What even? Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is wild. This is some like elite steampunk Cloud City vibes. What the, what the heck? I love this cape. Very well made, very sturdy. And this headdress is wild, dude. These frills. It's like, it's not a headdress. It's just clay on top of the, the bare elite head. Yeah, the clay, these are some kind of like goggles, I guess. And then like oxygen masks of some sort. Damn. A lot of molding on that one. Cool color choices. I like the silver piping. Matches his toenails there and his even his feet have a lot of molding on them. So impressed. So impressed. Last one. Oh, do we have to, do we have to end it? Is there only one left? Ooh. No way. Shut up. A Halo Combat Evolved Elite. You can recognize that headdress from anywhere. Shut up. The Gold Elite. Wow. I mean, where does the Mega Armor end and where does Matty Craft's custom work begin? He's clearly extended this chest piece. Oh, and cut out the middle. Fascinating. Not as much painted detail on this, but you don't need it. It's just a plain gold elite. Even on the camera, this looks like a McFarlane figure, bro. Like this, this looks really great. Damn. Okay, these, these three, straight up, I am blown away by. These are so awesome, particularly these two. Like, I don't even know what to make of that. That's so sick. And this brute as well. Man, I'm, I'm a sucker for the molding. They, he's just done such a good job with that. Then, uh, oh wow, a three flood. Particularly impressed with the roughness level of detail of this Spartan, but they are all great. And then uh, really nice to have an extra profit, especially just one with a little unique headdress. Thoroughly impressed. And guys, I think you, I mean, I'm sure you guys are uh, impressed too, right? Like what is not to love? By far my favorite is this Elite. I'm happy I got him out last. That was just random coincidence. Guys, if you can do anything today, it's like this video. Comment down below with your favorite of these figures and why, and subscribe to Matty crafts. He deserves it so much. If you comment down below which your favorite one is, I'll pick a winner of one of these and send it to you free of charge. Thank you so much to Matty for not only doing this video with me, but also your boundless patience while this parcel moved towards Hong Kong, back to America while I was in England. It, there were so many problems. And once I was eventually settled in Minnesota for a while, I had so many other projects and promises and it's been a lot to get through my uh, inventory here. But I really want to thank you for that. And I want to thank you for 
for these figures. They are exceptional. Shout out to just customs in general. They keep the community flowing and Matty Crafts is an awesome example of one of our legendary community members. I'll see you next time, guys. The Elite is signing off. What, 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 what?